You are probably interested in investing in crypto or you have considered it. Maybe you already have some crypto, but today I want to share why I decided to invest in crypto like five or even more years ago. I was like 18. Yeah, it was more than five years ago when I bought my first Bitcoin and other cryptocurrencies that were yeah, relevant at this point. And maybe the main reason that you got to understand is you are probably here because yeah, you see yeah, Bitcoin and cryptocurrency in general, they have a lot of potential and yeah, you can make a lot of gains. But there is even a deeper reason that you should consider, in my opinion, why you should invest in crypto because a lot of gains yeah, it doesn't really mean that it is something that you should get because, yeah, sometimes it's scammy, you might not understand it, you risk your money because everything that is really good also comes with a downside and in crypto it's the risk. Like still people, if you don't hodl and hodl basically means that you keep your cryptocurrency currencies over a long time then they probably lose some money because they are way too emotional. But cryptocurrencies are way deeper. The reason why you should invest in cryptocurrencies is basically in my opinion, it's a different store of value. Nowadays, when we have governments or governments that print a lot of money and yet don't really care in my opinion about inflation, then yeah, you know that the value of like the dollar, the euro or the Swiss franc that will inevitably go down. And yeah, that's an issue if the value goes down of your currency because you spend a lot of time getting, earning your hard earned money and then yeah, the government just yeah, prints more money and doesn't care about you. And I believe that's not good. And then you have to pull your money in an alternative asset that basically stores the value for you or stays at the same purchasing power or even increases your purchasing power. And then you have the choice. Yeah, I can invest in real estate. I can invest in stocks. I can invest in bonds. I can invest in gold, silver, watches, whatever you want to. But then you also can invest in cryptocurrencies. And in my personal opinion, this is not a, yeah, investing advice, but I believe that if you decide to invest in cryptocurrencies, there are some values in cryptocurrencies that are really important. The first value is that, yeah, cryptocurrencies are decentralized and that's a huge part. Like no government is completely in charge of Bitcoin, for example, because it's decentralized and all the transactions are open and yeah, the mining process verifies all the transactions, but that's a topic for a different yeah, video. And that's a huge part. But it basically means it's independent. Nobody can ever say, yeah, we are just going to print more Bitcoin just because we want to and need more Bitcoin. That's not possible. It's mathematically impossible to do that. There is a limited amount of Bitcoin that can ever be mined. It's actually 21 million Bitcoin. And in my opinion, if there is a limit to something and it's not inflatable, then it makes it worthwhile to invest into it because if the usability is good and Bitcoin has basically proven itself over the past years as the currency of the internet, yeah, then you might take the risk or the assumption that it will be there in the future. And yeah, then it's, uh, yeah, if you understand everything behind it, then it makes sense for me, for example, to invest into it. Because the other part where crypto is really useful is, for example, that you can send it wherever you want to. You basically just need a crypto wallet and you require, yeah, you just have 
then when you have the crypto wallet then you can send your crypto wherever you want to and that, that's great like if you want to take like 10,000 K or thousand dollars somewhere it's usually an issue you can't just easily do that and if you want to get send thousands of dollars from your bank yeah they ask you questions like why do you want to do that um, yeah can you prove me that you are you it makes all sense but it's your money you want to do that you have access to your account and then you want to get your money and if you can't do that yeah they basically yeah question your decisions and i i don't like that and that's why i also like crypto because you you have this freedom you you have this how do you call it yeah you just can't do whatever you want to do with your money there is no limit as long as you pay your taxes and everything they can't really hold back or say no you can't do that just because you yeah you have this bank account with that bank and they want to know why you want to get that money and buy some other stuff yeah i think that's a really important part about crypto that it's a limited um how do you say it is not inflatable because there are only 21 million bitcoins around it's decentralized nobody can ever really control it and you can send it wherever you want to there is of course a lot of other, other different stuff behind it like the technical stuff like the blockchain and everything but that's not today the topic of this video it's more like why yeah it has the power to be a good good store of value because it's yeah it's safe you can't really hack bitcoin because the the how do you say it the community like the worth of bitcoin the volume that's already that big that it's almost impossible to buy everything up so that one entity can control everything yeah that's basically the reason why i believe in cryptocurrencies and bitcoin and yeah tell me if you agree with my opinion we will see us in the next videos bye guys